This is team racing. Two teams of three boats are racing each other. Orange sails against blue. It's exciting, fast, and fun to watch. Team racing is much more of a game than, than a race. Um, so, it, you know, you can have, you know, countless matches and, and uh, you know, there's much more strategy. Uh, it's, you know, it's a fleet race plus so many more other things. Each team is trying to win by scoring the fewest points across the finish line. As in fleet racing, the boat that wins the race gets one point, the second one gets two. So a team that finishes second, third, and fourth can beat a team that places first, fifth, and sixth. The team with the least points at the end of the series of races wins, so team tactics are crucial. You don't have to win the race, and that the best team races in the world often give themselves up and they make themselves look slow and they're deceptive with their boat handling and they're able to slow down and speed up. Each race lasts less than 10 minutes and there are a number of them back to back so it's an ideal way to work together and practice skill and strategy. It's much more fast paced, uh, more athletic um, and especially in different wind conditions um, in light air, heavy air, it doesn't matter, you're always working pretty hard um, which is nice as a crew. There are two basic moves in team racing. The first is the pass back, where one boat blocks the wind of an opponent and prevents it from tacking, so other team members can get ahead. This is what it looks like on the water. Orange team shuts down the blue boat by taking the wind out of its sails. The second basic move is called a mark trap. This is when a boat positions itself in a legal way to block or slow down the boats on the other team. This blue boat is doing just that, sailing past a teammate to block the orange boat on the right. Team racing is growing with high school and college teams because it's a great way to become a better sailor and have fun with your friends. Team racing is really fun because you're, it's really, really a team sport and you're, all three of you are working together and you're only as strong as your weakest link, so it's a really good team building sport. Team racing, even at the most at the highest level, it still comes down to the fundamentals. And we work a lot on team speed, and we try not to overanalyze team racing too much with high school kids. It's also a great way for more experienced sailors to stay sharp. It's knowledge and skill and patience that pays off in team racing, so that older people can actually do well in it because they're more experienced and they're more patient, and they can they can think their way through the course a little bit more than some of the younger kids that try to just do it with physical ability. If you're looking for a challenge and fast-paced fun on the water, find a club near you and give team racing a try.